<laughs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another One Piece manga review. Sorry that this one's a tad late, but the full gang is back, baby. We're doing chapter 1088, final lesson. We got the full gang, myself, Jazz, and Verson. I'll start with Verson since he hasn't been on a video in a, in a couple, in a, like one. How you doing, Verson? Yeah, I haven't been on one, but it was kind of the most important one. You're, but I, then, in our defense, you were a little sick, sickly. Yeah, but I was willing to play through the pain for y'all. And then true, for, true, the, true, true. for those at home, this got delayed a little bit because then God smote me and took away my power. <laughs> hey, God smote me. It, me too. We both had internet issues. We both did. And 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 it's okay because the resident internet issue person was fine, which is crazy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, around a little here. bit. <laughs> <laughs> but glad you're doing well. Glad you're in full health and back kicking it with us. How you doing, Jazz? I'm good. I ain't, <laughs> the, I ain't gotta see the beer people for five days. Nice, nice. So <laughs> also, speaking of that, me and Jazz are going to DreamCon. So if you will be in the Austin area this upcoming weekend, the 28th, 29th, and 30th, come check out our panels. We're doing one on the 28th. I mean, one on the 29th, excuse me, from 5.30 to 6.30 in, hold on, I'll tell you exactly. I should have had, this happened last time. I should have had exactly yeah. what panel room. It is, but I'm going to get it in one second. If you have a disagreement with one Mr. Cornell D. God and what he'd be saying on TikTok, <laughs> now's the time to show up. Just saying, buy a ticket. Uh, well, no, they can't. They, <laughs> the ticket's been sold out for months. Fair. But, All right. But if you, if you're outside there, the convention, going, yell at him across the street. Facts. We will be at meeting room 614 or workshop room 1. Uh, 5 30 6 30 on Saturday. We'll be discussing the, it's called Anime Talk Presents the Master and the Student. Myself, uh, Krissa, and Jazz will be this breaking down the student and master relationship in anime, why it's an important aspect of anime, who, and who are the best representations of that. And then on Sunday, we'll be doing Anime Talk Presents a Conversation About One Piece, where Jazz, myself, and Krissa will discuss what makes One Piece so great, why is it important that it's the longest-running manga of all time. We will break down the importance of each straw hat and break down who are the most important side characters from 3.30 to 4.30, in meeting room 615 a b so make sure you come through but we're here today after the last review people are saying we was doing a lot of slandering and they were like oh no guy stepped up he stepped back up mm, get that honest justice shit honor you nigga we here. Wow. <laughs> we're Crazy. here. Lynn yeah. Is, Lynn, is, yeah. Lynn is not a fan of the future. Wow. We're here. Yeah. That nigga, that nigga caused Garp it's, to die. Oh. Where your observation? But we both get it. That's crazy. I mean, I'll give you that one. Uh, that, 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 Thank you, yeah, person. Yeah, that, one's, that, that one's valid. Okay, I won't lie. That one's valid. <laughs> Thank but you, like, person. To be but... fair, though, Garp <laughs> well, said it was. No, no I know. I, I, I know. We go. We go anyway, get to right, it. We go get to it. Get I just got to have a little fun because y'all be slandering some some people that be don't be deserving slander sometimes, and I and I feel like I got to defend them today, even though I'm not even in the Zoro Club. That's the crazy thing. I am a Sanji guy through and through. But y'all be y'all be hating. <laughs> you know what? As you said that, I've already crafted some new venom. So don't worry, we'll get to it. We'll get to it. <laughs> Let's review the chapter. Where we do this, I give a brief summary and then we go through and break down uh, parts of the chapter. It starts off with Garp talking to Kobe as a young boy, uh, and basically discussing the future and different lessons that he wanted to pass along to the next generation. We then see Kobe standing up and Garp telling him, "Hey." You got to you gotta destroy the hand. And he was like, uh, I don't know if I can. He was like, Kobe, you destroy the hand. Uh, Groose, you protect the ship from the rubble. And Helmeppo, you know, you just, you're just there. <laughs> do, 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 the, do, do whatever you can to help. And then, uh, and as they go and do that, they execute the mission. Uh, Kobe displays his move of honest justice. Meanwhile, Garp is basically distracting everybody, going ham, hitting a galaxy divide on them. We then see uh, a flashback to Kobe and Garp training. Uh, Kobe busts out his honest honest impact where he destroys the hand. We didn't see Groose catch all the debris. And Helmepo's uh, going, uh, I think he caught Kobe. If not, he uh, caught some other people. I'm pretty sure it's Kobe. Then they return to mm -hmm. the ship. They escape. We then see all of the uh, Blackbeard pirates around Garp. Uh, and basically, uh, Alkiji does the final blow or whatever you may think that may be. And then we then cut back to Ed Head as the Marines are arriving 
to Egghead. So I'm assuming we will begin in the beginning first and start us off this week. All right. Um, so yeah, obviously very good chapter. Um, yeah, I definitely obviously go from the beginning. It's a very it's a very linear story. I think the only thing that would maybe be different would be to do both like flashback scenes back together, maybe. Yes. Yeah, uh but yeah, other than that, uh, I'm down to like just run all the way down through the list. Yeah, that's cool. We could definitely start in the beginning. I do like uh, getting more garb stuff and teaching them and learning mm -hmm. what, you know, maybe lessons of the D's. And this is Garp's uh, version of what he thinks is right. Yeah, it's like his justice, which mm -hmm. it, it's almost kind of like my guy with the springtime of youth. You know what I mean? Where yeah, it's like, true, true, he's true, like, true. look, I'm washed. That's a, that's a good comparison. None of this matters. And like you said, the will of D, the dawn, preparing a new way for stuff, mm -hmm. terms of liberation shit. It, it is finally giving us a bit of an understanding about why Garp bothered to stay with the Marines, even after he hates the Celestial Dragons. And, you know, let's be real. Like, he definitely regrets some of the stuff he's done. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? He, I don't think he's the type of character who would ever say it, but, like, you can tell it in his heart. You know? Yeah, and, and he wouldn't say it because uh, because of the D stuff. Like, he, he made mm -hmm. a choice in how he wanted to live his life, and he felt that this was the best way to achieve that. Whether or not it's right or not, this was his choice, and he lived by mm -hmm. it and stuck by it and made the best that he could of it. And he respects whenever his other family members did it. He wishes that it was different, but, I mean, it's not like he went and beat up Dragon and tried to drag him into the Marines or whatever. Or tried know? to bring Luffy to jail. Like He, he yeah. let them all just do their thing. Mm -hmm. So, you know, Jazz, how you feeling about this chapter and you uh, where, where we're at right now? I think these these chapters are super important because not only because of like what i perceive the marines to be it's just i feel like we we get stuff from the marines but i feel like we always get negative it's like never negative pure. stuff like yeah even yeah. the good stuff but, has a drawback to it right but this this i just this i feel like completely how the marines sets should up. be honestly it mm -hmm. set it sets up Kobe to be the person he wanted to be in like chapter two when he mm -hmm. proclaimed when he proclaimed his dream to Luffy. Yeah, so for sure. I I genuine I genuinely I genuinely like that. Power scaling aside, it's all about narrative. You feel me? And Kobe's <laughs> next. That's all. I'm um, <laughs> also, <laughs> that on that bro. point, <laughs> um, it it feels extra fresh to me because as I've been mentioning, uh, I've been watching through old One Piece with my partner, taking uh, them the first time through. We just got done with Marine Ford. And, like, the fact that, like, Garp's narrative is the most important part of the Marines, basically, and his inner turmoil about it, and his uh, conflicting natures about it, um, I think it really shines really good right here, where you're seeing him stub up in a way that I think he wishes he would have been Marine Ford. And also, you know, for power uh, scaling juice, it also gives us a lot more impact on whenever he was like, hey, Sengoku, you need to hold me down, or I'm going to fucking murder this guy. And I, and I think he could have. I think yeah. he could have. Like, legitimately. I still think when we did our ratings of the Marines, I still think I was right. Where I had Al Alkindu number one, I had Garb two, and I still think I'm looking right. At, at this moment, at, at we, were, we were ranking the right now. Because this yeah. dude with a big old wound in his chest went from, hit basically some bing, 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 bings and went all the way up to that top of that skull and cracked it open. Pizarro's lucky he's not dead. <laughs> like, I, if that was the first punch, Pizarro's ass would have been done for. He literally threw San Juan Wolf, the largest being in existence, True. into in the, the ocean, ocean. Yeah. and San Juan Wolf never appeared again. Yep, not until the end. Through him. Not until the, the end of this chapter. Yeah, so he was end. out of commission for the whole battle, pretty much. Pretty mm -hmm. much, yeah, because his ass was there. And I don't know how they got him out of that water, too, his big ass. I would imagine. I think he's I just too big to really sink. Yeah, you know? I, I mm. think that's also like a, maybe that's also like a benefit of the island fruit. Maybe he could still mm. like raise somebody up from Yeah, under it depends on how far you mean island right. is, you know what I mean? True. Like, yeah. Because if, if it's a far distance out, he could just like lift up the sand. But what if his power is he, what if the power is he floats? Like, an, like. He gets as big as an island and he floats. Like, yeah, that would be like, crazy if he, too. If he's not like, if he can change his density with it, then yeah, I'd say yeah, that. Yeah. That would be that would be the like that and Alkiji's fruits are the only one that can kind of battle the the ocean, the natural enemy, mm -hmm. because he can freeze when he walks on. And if he can step on water and freeze it, then huh? There's no reason why if San Juan Wolf has the island float, he can't 
Flow yeah, and top. also and also we know for a fact that for a devil fruit to like get weakened, it's proportional to body mass and mm -hmm. it has to be like above a certain amount. So like you like a bathtub dump. wouldn't mess yeah. somebody up. Yeah. Yeah, it has yeah. to be like uh like free flowing water or whatever, and it has to be like up to your waist. Yeah, um, you know? yeah, up to your up to your waist to start affecting and like if it's here, you're mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, and then you're totally like done. For sure. Um, but yeah, I love seeing Garp do do his galaxy divide. That is bad. It just makes me think like Bro, how strong was Ron Rocks? Fucking garb, like, dude. like, yeah. How strong was Rocks to have to fight, uh, divine? I mean, uh, uh, divine. Uh, what, what's fucking Rogers attack? Divine departure. Divine departure in a galaxy impact. You're taking both of those, bro. What? And, and not just that, but also we know almost. It's almost canon at this point. White Beard eventually betrayed him, so White Beard was probably on that on, you know, the side of uh, Roger. Even if he wasn't on the side of Roger and uh, Garp, at the very least, he wasn't he left. fighting. Yeah, he wasn't fighting know, Roger. Yeah. He left. See, because I'm yeah. still not ready to say, like, I'm ready to just say he left because I'm not, uh, you mm -hmm. know, I'm I'm still not, I got to see it. But to your point, even, also, if, even if if it was there, you still got Garland, uh, whatever his name is. I was going to say, yeah, debatably, Garland is there. Yeah, it's debatable that Figurland Garland was also there. But still, um, man, like Rox mm -hmm. had to be insane to fight all of these. This, this, Garp's a monster. And it just makes you see how far Luffy, Zoro, and Sanji have to go and how they're not even not even close yet. And I mean, they're close, but like it doesn't feel like they're close when you see Garp do shit like this. Right. Like, this is a 70 year old um, man, right? Yeah, yeah bro. Yeah. Like, right. Garp is old. 70 year old man, heartbroken and retired. He's. Semi-retired. I'm sure he's still doing old man weight lifts. He's about to turn 80, bro. That's nuts. <laughs> yeah, he spends his days eating like soy crackers, dude, and hanging out with Sengoku and Son Sengoku's goat. And I know Sengoku ass yeah. can't do no shit like this. I know his old life. Him and Suru, they actually old people. Yeah, he ain't been in the field, though. <laughs> yeah, Sengoku true. Sengoku been out the field. <laughs> true, 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 true. All right, let's get to, let's get to Kobe's ass. I do like seeing him in Helmepo train in those flashbacks, and Kobe uh doing the uh the battleship. Yeah, come on, man. He's doing battleship bags yeah, as I like, like a that. fucking infant. Like, all right, you know what? Fine, let's get into it. Kobe is the is the rock leaf one piece. He's gone <laughs> farther than anyone. Usopp, back in Surf Village, you know, back in the day, at least he could snipe and beat up a fisherman. Kobe <laughs> was a fetus. He, he would have got smeared on the wall if he, he tried was. to do that, thing. That is fair. It, it's been he... two years, dude. I can say I can say this, even though I, I'm upset at Kobe for being a strong observation hockey user and got got tricked by pirate number 45, which is inexcusable in my book. His heart's his heart's too fucking pure. Inexcusable it's, in my book. I'm sorry. You got yeah, Odin got done. Odin got done the same way. Odin got done by narration and by somebody that was uh, actually important. At least wait, we wait, knew. Oh, I, I know you're about to say about the narration thing. I know. That's why I said it's no, 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 important. No. Oh, actually, hold on. If I and then Luffy got if, done that way. Wait, wait, oh, but, if but, I may, I if I may be the bad guy here, hold it's on, hold on. It's different. Wait, if I may be the bad guy here, they were impersonating Odin's son. Yeah, facts. Like, they, they, it, it, like you know what I'm saying? Like, I, it, it, I don't like different. to be that guy. Like, Kobe basically... <laughs> Kobe got tricked by someone but, wearing a horrible disguise in Pirate Number Forty Five. It wasn't, it wasn't but, even a disguise; it was just an innocent woman who then was like, "I got you, bitch." And and like, also, a... his observation is supposed to see people's nature. Like that's what he was doing at Marine Ford. You can't see that woman. Hey, how, sometimes how did Bruce? I mean, how did Bruce see it? That's that's some, what I want to know. Sometimes I learned be... his, his observation is about seeing people suffering. And in case you didn't notice, them pirates were suffering because and of that. And look. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> they, they had they had the fear of God in them because of Garp. He just misread the situation. Hell. He's a very good boy. Also, he, also, they told him everybody was off the island. That's another thing. You don't trust your people that they got everybody off after they told you. It's okay though. You you let your you let your guy die. Ace did the same thing. It's okay. He ain't, bitch ass he ain't dead. <laughs> Let's squash that room right out. He ain't dead. Well, that that's something we'll get to. We gotta get to because you know mm. he, he might not. That's be. crazy. But all, I, of Garp, I, all of Garp's children don't listen. That's why. Oh, yeah. listen, they don't do the right thing. <laughs> all right, and, for, but for the record, you know, just while we're on Kobe, we also get context for why Kobe gave himself up in the first place, which was, oh yeah. Blackbeard had literally every Marine who was mm -hmm. on uh on Amazon Lily yeah, copped really. up like several hundred people and Kobe was like you I'll, know I'll sacrifice myself for them, yeah. Eight hundred Marines in a battleship, bro. 
That's I mean, look, That's respect. Like I have a lot of respect for Kobe things that he's done. It's just it's just last chapter where he was looking like a fraud. But I I do agree with you in the sense of what he has done from when we met him to the fact now he can break damn near a battleship with his with his uh hockey fist. That says a lot. Like he's hey, not look, at Alkiji level, but look, it, it says a lot. I'd argue Kobe has a Kobe has a better growth rate than Luffy. I'd argue that. Oh wow. Then I everyone. I, I can't I say I'm that because wait, wait, I'd, I'd talk argue about, that. About, I gotta no, argue Luffy, this. I gotta let me say Luffy this. trained for like 10 years before he left the island. Luffy, Luffy, when he stepped up, could beat niggas like Arlo. <laughs> Luffy in after two years, years of he trained of, for 10 years, though. Yeah, for 10 years for sure. And then after two years, this nigga could beat Yonkos now. Until Kobe beats someone Whoa. like a Yonko, like I still don't think. I think Kobe right now is at warlord level. He might be I at, mean, at, but, at at crocodile. <laughs> but growth rate is not about where they are now. It's true, about true, 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 true. That is again fair. because he got Kobe. Think about it. Kobe two years ago was a fetus. Yeah, that's right? fair. All right, I'll a, give a you the growth lamb. rate thing. I'll yeah, give yeah, you the like, growth yeah, rate yeah. thing. That's fair. That that is. Yeah, fair. I'm not. I'm not saying. I'm not saying Kobe's stronger than Luffy. No. Yeah, because I'm about to say he's not even close. But I'm just saying he's not close to the. To the to anybody in the monster trio but in I'm Jim just, I'm just saying, if yeah, he could somehow get up, up there. And yeah, train, he could. I, 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 I think. You know I think saying? exactly. I think he could fight Robin. Yeah. I think he could fight Frankie. I think those would be good fights. But the monster trio and Jim Bay putting him in the dirt. <laughs> I will mid, say well, mid diff, mid diff, mid diff. Yeah, I was gonna say. I don't think mid-diff. it's like neg diff. It's no, no. It's not. It's not. He's not. He's not. He's not. He's not. He's not. But it's not hard. Yeah, that as well. He could have higher damage output, but he's not. He's not bringing, and he's he not, not bringing in any of the monster trio. He not doing Put nothing with Gear Five. He not doing nothing with our cyborg body. And Emma mm-hmm. gonna cut him alive. So I mean, we, that's just where we're I at. Know, I, I use an well, Emma, using Emma on a child is yeah. kind of that's kind of well, crazy. Let, let, let me ask what, a question. What are you supposed let to me do? Ask a you question. <laughs> let me ask you guys a question. Because I also watched Marine Ford, and I saw some characters who we don't talk about a lot put in a lot of fucking work. Um, admitting that Kobe uh, is not affected by it. Because that is a young gay man. Uh could he have could he have actually taken in both? Do you think he actually because you know I, I I literally like get like him being gay or whatever aside, say whatever you want. I legit don't think uh Bo's powers would work on him. The, the it, arrow don't get me wrong, she she can still like slap people around like a lot. I like, think the arrow would work on him. I the you just the so? natural of seeing seeing her. And turn into stone won't work. I agree with you with that, but I think that she, she can shoot arrows and turn observation. Into turn. Yeah, but also that, observation hockey though. That that that's true too. But true. like, I'm, say what you want. If it's a one v one, he's not going to get distracted. Yeah, no, no, for sure. Uh, um, I'm gonna say in turn. I think he's warlord level. I think he could be Moria for sure. Easy. I think he beat Moria. Mm. I don't think he's beating Crocodile. I don't think he's beating Doflamingo. Flamingo. He he would have beat Crocodile before Do- Crocodile got the rubber band to boost. True, 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 true. <laughs> Fair, because all he had to do was throw some water on him. But mm-hmm. I think I don't think he's beating Crocodile. I well, don't even think he's then beating... he's got he's got hockey like that now. I think he can th- fuck with Logias. Yeah. Like he hockeyed up his fist to destroy that mountain. I'm I'm picking Crocodile. I'm picking Do Flamingo. Oh yeah, Do Yeah. I'm picking Kuma. Yeah. And that the might thing be with Kuma in, is if Kuma touches you, then the fight ends. You're fucked. Yeah. I, um, yeah. that might be it. That I, I that might be it because I don't know what Weevil can do. So Weevil's TBD. Um, mm. obviously I'm not counting Mihawk because that's that, or Buggy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, that, said something. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we're not counting that. That nigga yeah. getting washed. Buggy, of course, I think he's beating, but you know, Buggy got the story shit. Oh, he, yeah, and he's gonna be counting Law. Lo- he's not beating Law either. So I think it's a better fight than. One would think. I'll say that. Law? No, bro. I can't do that. No, I mean, I'll give you a kid though. <laughs> Law just got Law just got, Law just got fucked up. By Blackbeard. And yeah. he was fighting their whole his whole crew. Come on, man. Don't do that. Don't do Dude, that. we literally we literally have feats for fucking uh Kobe being able to like swim underwater like a fucking dolphin. Sure, sure, and, sure. And but just I'm as not, strong. I don't think Dude, if Kobe, Kobe hold on, let's let's not say Kobe versus Law. Let's say Kobe yeah. versus the Polar Tang. You think he's like if he fucking gets a good hit on it, he's gonna bust the Polar Tang wide open? Oh, I mean, like sure, 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 sure. Yeah, sure. That, and at that point, and at that point, Law dies. But I'm we on land. My, my nigga, right. my nigga, Law is rooming that, and then awaken Law. 
that's a different monster. I feel like, like I feel like if you're not like I feel like if you're not Yonko levels of hockey, you really can't do much to. You can't do nothing to Law. I don't think I don't think he's there because I don't. To be honest. I don't know if his hockey is better than Alkiji's right now. Like to me, yeah. I'm looking at it as Kobe is the strongest Marine under the Admirals. He sh- he should be a vice admiral. He I should, think. yeah. Like it's, I would say power. he's the strongest ones under Admirals, and I think Law, Kid, Luffy, Zor- they are Admiral only fight. Like you know. Their yeah. average level of okay. ain't, ain't no way Kobe should be the same level as Tashiki. I'm sorry. Oh, <laughs> ain't no, ain't they, no they're way. They're his slander. Go get it off, yeah, brother. That's, not, that's off. not even slander. I'm just being. I'm just being. Where was, she, where was she at, Jazz? Sitting on well, the I, side. Well, 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 okay. Look, look. To to Tashiki's defense, she was the only one thinking logical. They were shooting Pizarro's hand with cannonballs. Don't know why they were doing that. Why but she didn't Tashiki cut it? Was like, bro. <laughs> but Tashiki was like, yo, hit the deck because like <laughs> hit, hit the, the deck, deck or like no jump in the water because like if it hits the boat, like we're done. So I was like, okay, strategic <laughs> from Tashiki. Look, Look wh- why crumbs. she ain't cut it? Why she why it. she ain't cut it? <laughs> because you, you know better? who they was she waiting for? <laughs> who they was waiting for? Who they was waiting for? Broad ass nigga. Who smoke? Broad- that not no. nigga Bogart. <laughs> Bogart. Uh, where was I'm his on... bitch ass at? Nowhere to be. I don't even know if he in the chapter, bro. Like yo, nigga Garp dying, and you not there. If if Law was dying, hey, bitch ass Beppo was there. If hey, well, kid was Beppo dying, like that. I got, on, on. I got, yeah, him. I say, I Beppo got. Like dude, Beppo so long is fucking great. Beppo, Beppo only got one feet. Yonko. That nigga only got and... one feet. That's too long. I give it to him, but I'm saying he'd have been there to protect law. Killer, ride or die. Would have been there to protect kid. Yeah. Zoro would have been there to protect Luffy. Shit. Even fucking Bartolomeo would have been there to protect Luffy. All the straw hats would have been there. But Bogart, man, Garp, you better find you a better wingman, my nigga. Cause that That's nigga crazy. They said he was whack. in the last chapter, and bro has not moved since. <laughs> bro is, what is, <laughs> I, still, it, what I still if... don't think he was in the last chapter. <laughs> Hmm. He was in it for like a panel, I think. But let me ask you a question: What if Bogart got off the ship and went into tiding on Hutch? You know, I, I'm I'm pulling at straws. Oh yeah, I'm, you giving you you, you trying to give him something? That nigga ain't there, bro. I ain't see Bogart. No, he's not on the ship either. So he <laughs> evidently he walked <laughs> off. Man, Bogart at his house. <laughs> Bogart at his house smoking cigarettes. He watch. He watch it. Hey, look, he watching the game like they're doing in JJK right now. <laughs> not part of the fight. Bogart. <laughs> But I will say, gotta give Kobe uh, the the his honest justice, hocking up his hand or honest impact. That was that. That's a feat. That's a feat. That's a big feat. Uh, hey. I will. I will halfway agree. The the name is kind of lame, but at the same time, it's like, did you expect I'm, anything better from Kobe? He's a fucking dork, and that's and, why I like him. And he's pure justice. Like he's the yeah. he is what the Marines are supposed to be. This is what Garp used his D for to find somebody like him. To make change, Garp's legacy is being passed to Kobe, and Kobe's gonna be the one to, you know, carry it on his version, Garp's version of freedom, Garp's version of justice, and and that's that's who he's hoping takes it to the next level. And honestly, Kobe right now is putting himself up for when all this ends to be an admiral, or you know, the he's not old enough to be the fleet admiral, but he's putting himself up there to be an admiral. I don't know he who will, will be the fleet he admiral. will be fleet at, he will be fleet admiral one day at is some it point after yeah. The sto- yeah is it after the story ends very hard, very possible yeah. honestly but, Alkiji probably might come back and honestly if we because I mm-hmm. still don't think his ass is it evil. depends yeah it depends on how this stuff ends up because when you, you see him uh, sitting there with them eyes covered that was him showing he wasn't crying that's why he was freezing himself mm-hmm. um y'all think Kobe's gonna unlock conquerors at some point. Uh, I have I look I have big issues with this because my thing is this if he unlocks it then my then this nigga right here better unlock it. I mean I'm already there. I'm already there. I know you are. I'm 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 I I, I know I know both of y'all are, but there's people out there. But I'm also the kind of person who doesn't think conquers is the end only be all, and that sure being conquers means that you deserve to get sucked off either. So fair, you know, yeah. fair. And look, I just don't think because the argument for Sanji is he doesn't show kingly ambition, and if Sanji doesn't show kingly ambition, then Kobe definitely don't. Mm-hmm. Like yeah. I de- they both need character right now. Both of them need some sort of character change or progression. I think. Like for I'm not sure. going to deny that part. Yeah, yeah. But I'm I will saying- say 
Kobe I might have uh advanced advanced armament. I can give him that. That's what his mm-hmm. lightning the thing, is. The thing about the thing about yeah. it that was like such a topic of discussion for the past week was like the fact that you have the like you see the black lightning and then you see the effect of the attack after. Mm-hmm. So like I'm okay if it is advanced armament. I'm not that's sure what I think I it is about. I'm not sure how I feel about <laughs> it being advanced conquerors because seeing what Zoro and like Luffy had to go through just to get, I don't think like, it is it and it's like and they only they only like um uh, when they got it it was like it wasn't at like the output that like you know other like like yeah, the yeah, other yeah. Yonkos had. it wasn't it so, wasn't there yet and and I'm, I'm not sparking right and I'm not mad like I'm not mad if he has it or if he doesn't but no nah, I definitely I think but... I think that's advanced because it's literally the no touch and the spar I I like because until... Katakuri did because Katakuri did the same thing but oh, he and... wasn't a confirmed advanced conquerors usually. At the at, well, advanced, he, he, advanced yeah. No, no, I'm talking about I'm talking about like the black sparks around the fist. Not oh, like but no, but the, I mean, look, that's yeah. uh when I mean when they show the no touch, I mean that that at first it was claimed as mm-hmm. as, as advanced uh advanced uh yeah. armament, which I do. But it think might have just is. been like it might have just been Rio. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah right. that's what I said. That's, yeah, yeah. I, Rio yeah. advanced armament, same thing. That that's which what by, I think that is. Which, by he the person. way, I'm just I'm just gonna point it out just because he's not gonna get much play at all, in part because of Lynn's master way of describing what he did. Uh, I think Helmeppo used Skywalk to save Kobe. Oh well, good, good for you, Helmeppo. You know, like Hel-Mepo I, th- I think that's the. I think, yeah, why not? Good, that, good like, for that's, you, that's, you that's... bitch ass nigga. Hey, come on, man! Like, he, he, took that bomb, sure he took that bombs for his man. Don't man, do that to Helmeppo. Taking a bomb, you should have cut that bomb. We know swordsmen. See, we. Uh, I'm not giving passes. We know swordsmen that would have cut that bomb. <laughs> okay, but. They like they swordsmen. That's all they do. Helmepo. He, Helmepo he is from, a swordsman. What? He ain't from that. He don't even use swords. He used them big kitchen Dude. knives. Yeah, I say Helmepo is <laughs> them boys. Them boys. Look, look, not a sword. Look, look, Helmepo look is Shanks. Helmepo is Shanks. Helmepo is a hockey man. He's not a swordsman. That's <laughs> the I ain't say. Nah, I see, I ain't say all that. Put that in the episode title. People will watch it. I'm telling you. This gotta be this gotta be the short section. Everybody going to <laughs> I know. And this is why I can't this is why I'm not Wait. on the card because I would get Wait, jumped. man. I know y'all not talking about the god like that. Hold Come on, in. be fair. No, it's not y'all. Jazz never said a word. Be like, fair. I, didn't say nothing. <laughs> I, didn't say I know nothing. you're not disrespecting the god who made a admiral leave from 50 miles yeah, away. Yeah, you're right. The god, one piece from red. The god. <laughs> no, the god shakes. Now, shakes. Now, available, now available on streaming platforms. Let me tell you what would happen. Shanks would, Shanks would sneeze <laughs> and Helmepo would explode. You know, contrary you to say, that, yeah, you I, say I that like that's a feat. <laughs> that's a feat. <laughs> Shit. Hey, cause look, hey, look, cause what Shanks say, don't don't <laughs> underestimate the youngins. He was talking about Hell Meppo, not <laughs> Man, look, Hell Meppo is definitely a swordsman. Them two, <laughs> them two bitch ass blades couldn't cut hey, a fucking don't, don't bomb. Kukri are very cool. It's just <laughs> unfortunate Hell Meppo's using. I, I love Kukri's. Jazz calling a kitchen knife. That's a big. That's a big ass. Kukri. His hey, ass look, is a bitch because he couldn't cut a fucking bomb. Hey, shout out to Groose, man. Groose don't have none of this training and out here balling. I'm giving Groose Yeah, love. I say, honestly, yeah, Groose for not being a fucking freak has mm-hmm. been using his devil fruit exceptionally. Beautifully. And like all Groose, man, if Garp would have put a little bit of time into Groose, Groose would have been a monster. Groose oh, is a little God. bit of time. Yeah, I gotta go look back actually because I think people were saying like Groose is in the flashback. Like, yeah, yeah, he is. First, yeah, he's in the first. Yeah, in the like, first so, one in the lesson, but he not in the. No, like... no, no, no. But that's what I'm saying though. So keep in mind, Groose. We don't know if he had his offer to that point, but he's been a Marine only about as long as Kobe has, maybe a little mm-hmm. bit more, because he probably he probably was a chore boy level, but he was like a seaman recruit or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like he also has had an amazing amount of uh, oh for sure of growth because he's a rear admiral. For that's sure. I'm with you. Advice. Like I just wish all... he got the the garb training because if he'd have no, got the garb yeah, training, yeah, I agree. He, I agree. He, People make fun of him for it, but I kind of get it. Because imagine working your ass off, being really good with a very weird devil fruit, and like giving a fuck about the Marines and even being a sword member, and then suddenly Garp brings the whole crew to go save this little fucking <laughs> tiny little dude. Run. And, this, and then and then it's over here like, oh yeah, Kobe is the my dear the future in the future yeah. of the Marines. You know, you know what it like, reminds me of? 
like you know what it reminds me of you remember that scene when sasuke and naruto were on the roof like on that rooftop and they like you know rasengan chidori and mm-hmm. sasuke was like haha my thing like my thing blew a hole you yours couldn't and then he walks behind the, back, the yeah. water well and then the whole thing is exploded i feel like that like i feel like that was kind of like this chapter not to the same extent because they're not Gruus and kobe aren't enemies but like mm-hmm. it's kind of just like to show the gap between like also different kobe's powers. him and True, yeah, yeah, true, 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 true. Because Groose, like, keep it, yeah, keep in mind, Groose Groose held up had, all that shit though. Like, yeah, he's way more versatile. Yeah. Like, he can just straight up do more stuff, and he can make his own army, as Ooh. I've shown with you guys on our D and D sessions. Good, good for Hell Meppo for Skywalking. Good for his his bitch ass. Also, wait, take, so, take that did, visor did, off your eyes. Did, did more than Tashigi, <laughs> and guess what? Tashigi did more than Smoker. Before these chapters dropped, oh! some people saying Smoker was that guy. Yeah, There's I ain't lying. Smoker, Smoker, if Smoker right. is not on egg, if look, Smoker's man. not on Egghead. <laughs> look, we might have to look. We we are actually giving out a lot of subpoenas. I don't know if we have enough. To she to Smoker did more than Tashigi, and his ass wasn't even here, bro. Get that get Tashigi out of here, bro. Oh, now see, that's dude, crazy. Get, he sounded, you he know sounded what, like Gay Gay and Horikoshi right now. I can't. Yeah, dude. What's up? Hey, but you know who I'm rock. No, 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 because you know I'm team Habari. She killed the game. Habari killed the game. She saved everybody. I'm team Habari. Where was Tashigi in that? Sitting her ass on the boats, crying, scared. I ain't gonna lie. What you know, this isn't gonna turn into a I'm just saying, you know, I've done it. Yeah, I'm, I'm, just done I'm just saying, can you see how it's wrong to give Tashigi a powerful woman, give all her clout to her male uh I gave boss? it to Habari. I gave That's it to clout. Habari. All the clout goes to Habari. Her male boss definitely did better than Huddle. I will say that. Crazy. I was just going through the chapter. God damn, dude. Garp literally going boo, 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 boo. Off God, that fucking... was insane, bro. That's what I'm like. I, I still dude. go back to that page. And then he tells fucking Alkiji, you're soft. Soft. <laughs> dude, people, people tried to say that Garp was old. People said Garp was... Now, crazy, I thought he not, was not done. Most people, but... I, I I legit yeah. thought he was done, and like you know, I don't. I let's talk about that. Do we think he's dead? I, I mean, as of now, I mean, now, I I know he got that spike coming out of his look, chest. When you but, initially told me this, but is it even coming out of his chest, or is it on top fair. of him? Is it and look, like he's not time, impaled yeah, midair yeah. with it. He could be know? time capsule, just like Saul was. Like or Alkiji could have like cauterize the wound, like with ice burns or something like that, and just put that spike play. up. Yeah, but <laughs> also it's kind of just like. Also, it's kind of just like Garp can't be dead because they just lost Kobe as their bargaining chip and they gained Garp. Mm-hmm. So it's yeah. like, so it's like if Black, like, so it's like if they had like, you know, off the Garp, Blackbeard would have been so pissed at them. Right. And yeah, and then, he's like, oh, we lost all of the all of the all like of tribute play. we had, all yeah. of the bargaining chips. Right. And then you murdered Garp, the hero who we probably could have got like three times as much than fucking mm-hmm. Kobe. Right. And then also the fact that there's the pudding, there's the pudding plot. Mm-hmm. Right. And Garp probably has memories of a lot of stuff. I'm not I'm not sure what to speculate on. I mean, the first thing I would think about is God Valley and what they went there for. <clears throat> but Blackbeard seems more interested in like his He seems more interested in be- yeah, and becoming a celestial so, dragon. And the I mean, best person to do probably- that. Is Garb yeah. to have, yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. So he'll probably he'll probably take Garb. Like, there's just more benefits. And that's kind of what I thought when this whole rescue arc was happening. I was like, there's more benefits to having Garp as a prisoner than there well, is to having Kobe. Hold on, though. Also, this, also, this will potentially blow smoke uh, in Aokiji, Aokiji's face because Garp also is like retired and sword and blah, 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 whatever. True. Um, and they don't this really is gonna, care this about is gonna, this, in the this is what This is what's going to this is what's going to put Aokiji to the test if what he said was actually true. Now, granted, I will say as cover for him, if there was anyone they were going to break that rule for, it would be fucking Garp mm-hmm. or an admiral. Like, let's let's be real about it. Facts, but like this, also, this might blow but also it helps him though because out of anybody that would keep his secret and die with it is Garp. Yeah. So mm-hmm. it go, it runs both ways. Also, this helps Luffy versus Blackbeard because you know Luffy got to go save his grandpa, man. I th- <laughs> yeah, I think basically I think his Garp's grandpa did. I think Garb's got a few more scenes left in him one way or another. I do too. Wait, but by the way, just real quick, we're leaving Hachinosu. Mm-hmm. What the fuck happened with Perona and Gecko Moria? Oh, they did. <laughs> I assume they did. No, I assume they, no, no. I, I thought they did. Away, but like, I thought they dipped. But, I think, but we never man, saw. Look, we, but man. we never. We somebody never saw got that Moria devil actually. Fruit. 
<laughs> on the island. Kobe was supposed to go free him. I don't know if nope. Kobe ever actually did. Moria, Kobe, you Black, snake. Blackbeard got Mori devil fruit somewhere. If he alive, for sure he got somebody devil fruit somewhere. I don't see, think I don't again, think Blackbeard I, let Mori dip out without taking his fruit. Hell no. See, I, I think it's a lot like the same thing with Law, where I think it's easier with a highly technical weird devil fruit like that. It's easier to try and save the person and make them do their shit than tr- get some we'll random to like eat a very powerful and that's like very technical devil fruit to learn how to do it. Uh, yeah, it's like, I, like I think I, that's I just you, un- you uh, mastery. Unless it's somebody in his crew, because I do think somebody like in his crew could take it. And you know his crew could, are all stupid and have no loyalty, and he knows that. I thought they, wait, I thought they were all wait, wait, I thought all the Blackbeard pirates were accounted for for having devil fruits. Well, well all the captains at least, uh, not unless they have the, people under them. I the on, the literally only person that we don't know, and I see. mean we've seen him do something that's devil fruitish is the feet. Because and Lafitte has, has like that angel, weird angel fruit shit. Yeah, he is angel. And angel wing. Yeah, not angel fruit. Oh, anyway, angel, um, angel fruit. Angel fruit but, be kind of fun. Yeah, but while you look that up, I, I, uh, hey, Lynn, here's that venom I was cooking up earlier. Um, got, do you think uh, Mihawk's bum ass can afford to pay the tribute for Garp? Because <laughs> I'm just saying, last I checked, they're, uh, he's a young broke boy. <laughs> for and, sure, they um, are broke. <laughs> that, that That's not venom. They are broke. That's okay. <laughs> they, but I do think, look, I don't think he even want to mess with that shit, bro. I don't think the niggas want to even mess with uh Garp. That's somebody well, that's like. Really? Well, I mean, to yeah, be that's honest, their whole, they they have to honor it. If like they actually I mean, have to oh, honor. Oh, if the they bounty. bring him, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 If they, if they like, bring, they him, have then, to. They gonna they gonna pay him at some point, <laughs> you know. Or Buggy gonna die. <laughs> oh, don't do that to my pirate well, king. He's the leader. What are you talking wait, about? Hold, 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 hold on, hold on. Wait a minute. Are you saying that Mihawk can't protect his Yonko? Because uh, I mean, are you Zorka? saying that oh, the wait, number wait. two can't but, ride for his number one? Are, are, I thought Crocodile yeah, was number and, two. And, Isn't his Crocodile's organization? So his Crocodile not number two? That's not his organization. Wow. And also, so you don't even think Mihawk's also, number two? Wait, but wait, are we saying a Yonko Amazing. can't fight another Yonko? Y'all's king can't fight his own battles. But see, he's. Uh, the- I'm sorry. Wait, did Marco he- protect Whitebeard? Marco but, uh, protected Whitebeard. But but when kings just- fight, kings have to fight other kings. Uh, Marco didn't fight Blackbeard. Whitebeard did. So why is it? Uh, you're Buggy? assuming that. Why, why is it Buggy? That Black- why is Buggy not why- fighting his battles? Is he not the young? Why are you assuming? Why are you assuming that Blackbeard's on Buggy's level? No. I, I don't. I don't know why you would ever make that mistake. Oh, well, if he's not on his level, then it should be an easy fight. You gotta Why understand, Oda, Oda put the parallel in Fish, uh, Oda put the parallel in Fishman Island when Zoro and Sanji like clap those two fishmen to let Luffy walk. Crocodile and Mihawk. Oh yeah, Crocodile and Mihawk go fight Shiryu and and Burgess. Uh, Buggy can't run from this. Oh no, no, Mihawk's fighting Blackbeard. Didn't, didn't you know? No, 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 no. He has wait, to wait, solidify wait, himself. Wait, as no, no. Promise. I thought, I thought that Zoro and Sanji took out the right hand and left hand. So that's Mihawk and Crocodile. So Buggy no, 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 no. can handle his business. Understand. You gotta so understand. Buggy yeah. running no, from, no, this is so this is outlier, outlier, running from. Yeah. Y'all running? <laughs> no, see, y'all running? No, <laughs> no, no. Buggy's never run a day in his life. Buggy's okay, never well, run then, a day in his life. Cool, cool. Let's see him fight Blackbeard. Cool. I'm glad we. I'm glad we're cleared up on that. Cool, cool, cool. I mean, so if y'all y'all go don't fight, though, ba- so if y'all y'all go don't fight, he a fraud. All I'm saying is, well, the- all I'm saying is MKB. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> I'm saying kills Blackbeard. I'm, I'm saying BKB. Buggy kills Blackbeard. <laughs> mm, well, the I thing like that, that is though. <laughs> yeah. Well, the thing about it is though, we got to remember Blackbeard does use a knife, which means he's a swordsman. Which means that if anything, but, but, but Buggy, oh wait, see, see, but see, wait, we figured you 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 unlocked the even better thing for me. Blackbeard used yeah. knives. Buggy used knife. Knife on knife combat, mm-hmm. baby. Knife on knife combat. Mm-hmm. Knife on knife. But does Devil it, the road, oh, so we're, the road so we're, man so we're just admitting that Mihawk's no longer in the conversation for Well, no, no, so no. no. I mean, Lord we said the wings is Blackbeard and Buggy. No, no. We're saying they it's knifers. The, They're the shankers. Between those two. They shankers. They they roadmen. We saying swordmen versus swordmen. Shiryu versus Mihawk. Wow. And then and then mm-hmm. therefore mm-hmm. Zoro fights the winner. Mm. But for real though, Sherry is looking. <laughs> Sherry is looking pretty sad right now. He, oh, he, he died. He smear on the paint. Blackbeard, like, Blackbeard pirate performance where is, is actually he? terrible. Like, where, oh no, Sherry right there. Don't do that. He's standing right there. He's, yeah, he came back after he got his shit slapped. <laughs> oh, for sure, for sure. And then Alkiji finished the job. And then uh, look, Alkiji, like, oh, the strongest man. one of them. Them, them Blackbeard crew 
looking like Luffy crew could take them niggas out easy. <laughs> them boys str- the- <laughs> struggling with Kujaku. With Marines? Yeah. <laughs> them boys struggling with Hibari. No diss to Hibari. That's my. No, no, that's he, real. Dog. That's real. Them dog, niggas struggling but- with, they struggling with Kujaku, Hibari, and bitch ass Hell Meppo. You niggas need to get out of here, boy. Vasco, I'm alive. Vasco shot was team killing like it was fucking Team Fortress 2, and he was a pyro just letting everyone They up. couldn't. Look, I'm gonna keep it a bean. The Blackbeard Pirates in this fight could not be the Beast Pirates. I'm standing look, on that. I'm one. taking ha- look. I'm taking <laughs> Hamlet over all those Blackbeard Pirates. <laughs> Hamlet gets shit done, <laughs> dude. The, the thing is, though, like Lafitte's gonna have to hard carry this. I'm not gonna lie to you, Lafitte. He's gonna have to go into Egghead. He's gonna have to get upgrades for all these chumps. <laughs> hey, in- look, inshallah, he will find something amazing. I'll teach you. Real right hand man of the sh- of the Blackbeard Pirates. Let's let's keep it a stack. <laughs> let's keep it a stack. <laughs> well, okay. Before before we get to the end of the chapter, when we go back to Egghead, um, so in the first flashback, no, the second flashback, when they were when Kobe was giving himself up for uh for the Marines on the bat that were going to be on the battleship going to Hachinosu, um, they 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 know that he's in sword, but like mm-hmm. the Marines do, yeah. Yeah, yeah, but I'm like, sword is super secretive. But I, I okay, like, I so guess I that think is, it, dude. That's I that's think it is. So I, I think it is the he's one of the people that they know. Like, I don't think they know the undercovers, and I don't think he's an undercover. You know what I'm saying? Like, but I to versus, oh, because he's probably too honest about it. And to versus yeah, well, point, that sword shit is fake. But uh, th- like the people like X Drake, I don't think everybody knows. But Kobe is yeah. like a, a um. A liaison, yeah. That's a Kobe. Kobe never did that infiltrated Yonko crew thing. Mm-hmm. He's a liaison. Like he, he never, so like he never got burned like that. You know what I'm talks, saying? He talks to the Marines for the undercovers, essentially. And not just that, but at least the way they framed it, and I don't know how much variable truth it is, and maybe like it's just lying in general. It makes it they make it seem like if Kobe is sword, he did that like very, 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 very recently. Story. Yeah, like because well, you can't be the, you can't be the second coming of the hero of the Marines and and like and do what technically you did. have yeah. quit. Exactly, yeah. you can't be what what he did at uh whatever law and they did at um whatever Rocky fucking I, yeah Rocky is and be a sword becoming member. more important as the days go by because I'm like what yeah what, what happened, happened there, there? Like, will literally. we ever learn who knows. <laughs> But, I think we have to just because there's three important characters who will true. be important. No, no, fair, fair. But and now you would think they would have talked about it in by this now. Arc. Yeah, by you now. Know, this would have been the or arc at to least do the it. law yeah. Blackbeard arc. I mean, Blackbeard's crew was fighting the two people that were involved in the incident simultaneously, and we didn't get anything from it. Now was the time Which, you would assume. By the way, can can I just say real quick? I know that it's housed inside of it, but is this even the fucking egghead arc? It's called the future island arc, but like we spent the last literally five months in real life. Not oh, this is the head. this is the flash. It's Reverie part. too, dude. <laughs> yeah, well, this is like, this is wrong. I love it, but part of me is like, man, this makes Egghead feel kind of disjointed as this a is the around the world arc, brother. Well, we see yeah, it's, what happens around the world. Wait, it kind of makes it's sense literally because Reverie on, too, because on it's Punch they Wanda. got Shaka, they got Shaka, and Shaka is based off Daft Punk. So that makes sense. Mm, around the world. Uh, mm-hmm. uh, I see where you're going with it. Okay. All right. Well, now we back to Egghead. So we'll see what happens with the Straw Hats after break when we come back from DreamCon. That's pretty much everything. I think I think we had a lot of fun yeah. here. Hey, I Lu- hope, hey, I hope Luffy, some of y'all know hey, some of this was hey. jokes. Like, I hope y'all know what was jokes. I stand by wasn't. everything I said. <laughs> I, know I was do. not joking. Oh, I know God, both I was not. Look, I know both of you do. I know. Y'all tell them. Uh, first, tell people they can follow you on social media. All right. Well, let me just say, before you know where you can follow me, if you want to find me, I stay over at Mr. Lynn Burden's <laughs> house. <laughs> So if you have problems with what I have to say, you, you go talk to Sheila about it. All right? Hey, Sheila, nah, hey, not bringing Sheila. Sheila, Sheila like, handle yeah. up for you. Like that's real. She a real one. She rides. She, she's a beautiful dog. She's but, just scared of other dogs, but humans. Oh, she'll she'll take a human out in a second. <laughs> um, but yeah, you can follow me over at uh. Well, actually, real quick, th- uh, this does paint a new light for admirals, and I'm glad we do get some admiral feats, just like. Tertiary wise, you know what I mean? Between Aokiji and Garp, I think that's oh, for sure. been needed, especially because we're about to fucking fight Kizaru. So I think it's been important context to get it. Anyway, but all right, if you want to follow me, follow me over at Verse in the Vassal. Um, I'm going to be doing a lot of work in, um, in the next couple months 
for a lot of uh, policy work and stuff. So if you want updates on that, a lot of cool stuff happening. Uh, might throw some more events together. We'll see how that goes. Uh, so version of the Vassal pretty much wherever. Follow me on um, Twitter. Follow me on Instagram. I think it's still Twitter. If it's not, I'm going to call it Twitter. I don't care. Um, you know, is what it is. Hell yeah. All right. Um, Jazz, help you where they can follow you at on social media. First off, my boy Luffy ain't taking no L's here. Oh, I yeah, he's not about to lose to whatever. No, like, he's a fucking emperor now. Come on, guys. Does like, the title a, a, mean something? Everybody, no, 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 wait, but, everybody you know who thinks they're about to but lose, I'm they talking, clowning. But you know what I'm saying? I'm talking to two specific fandoms, one specific fandom, derogatory. Um, But aside from that, you can follow me <laughs> on Twitter, Real Jazzy about, Boy. Yeah. You can follow on, me Jess. on Instagram, Jazzy hey. Boy. You can follow me on TikTok, Cornell D. I'm talking about kid fans, bro. They've been whining <laughs> all Dude, week. They he's dead. All he's been dead week. for like several months. Yeah. Look, they, Whatever, lucky right. that, they lucky my figure's still there because he's supposed to be in the dirt. But don't worry. Like, what, you, you think, you think just because your, man, your man's up the steal on somebody he wasn't supposed to up the steal on, Luffy's supposed to lose, and he, and he you know, yeah. I'm not even going to go. I'm sorry. It's fair, though, Jazz. They're equal. Look, the rivals. The thing They're is, rivals, they didn't Jess. realize that kid fought the god. When you fight the god, that's what happens to you, bro. Not like even that, bro. Not even look. Not even that. <laughs> this man, you know, you know what this man did. This man, this man rolled up into his hood, and you know what he did? He pointed the gun at Shanks's and then shoot his hood and didn't shoot and didn't you know shoot. He tried to blow. He tried to blow up the daycare center he and the old folks home you know what he at the same did? time. He should have used his future site. That's what he should have did. Oh, wait. He don't have none because he's a bitch. He should have used his Conker's hockey. Wait a minute. Oh, wait. He a bitch. I'm sorry. He should have used his... Oh, oh, never mind. He don't have nothing. Sorry. Look, Eustace, I used to love you, but your fans make but, me but guys, he's super strong because he almost murdered a bunch of basically civilians. <laughs> That's right, a great feat. Let's, let's get out of Whatever. here. We clock. We clock. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. There's no, like honestly, Lucky Rush should have handled it. Right. Whatever. Y'all oh, go follow nah, nah. my. Mother. They wouldn't have liked to hear me of Lucky Rubik. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all go follow Jazz in person. You follow me at LimbyWT. Follow Bros Who Think at Bros Who Think. Until next time, we'll see oh, y'all at also, DreamCon. Oh, which also Manga Maze Mel- is about to drop another episode. Me and Bro are going to try and record one this weekend. Okay, lit. So, y'all make sure y'all check yes, that out as well. All right, well, but yeah, we'll be back post DreamCon. Until then, peace. Thank <music> you.